Long live the castle. With that, he was Devil's spore. Gotta figure out if I have the right quest. Oh yeah, we're gonna do the shrieker. I advise you well. Now we <laughs> left off exactly where we left off, which is nice. All right, this is a battlefield. Best thing to do battlefield is to get the hell out of the battlefield. <laughs> All right, Roach knows what to do. Let's see if we can get Roach to do his thing. Hey, zombie. What up? How's your day going? Playing anything today? What's your plans, dude? I never know what you guys are doing. <laughs> I know what I know what Meg is doing, at least a little bit of his day. That is uh working. Working like a dog. <laughs> Community gift chest thing pops up. Stuck. It is? I wonder if I can do anything about it to where I can like turn it off. I wonder if there's like a uh, options in the channel. To where I can tell I can turn off community gifts, uh, gifting or anything like that. Unless you guys know something about it. Man, I don't like things that might bug you guys, so. If there's anything that's bugging you and I have a, the option to turn it off, let me know. Because <laughs> I noticed it was recently popping up too, so I don't know. <laughs> I just blocked it with you block. <laughs> I fixed it. <laughs> I fixed it in which, you know, Twitch doesn't like it, but I fixed it. <laughs> hmm. Oh yeah, so I think today during Witcher, I'm gonna try and do some more Gwent. Speaking of Gwent, I wonder if she has any cards. There's a floating kitty that hissed at me. He's an arse, not a baron. A bandit with sorry rabble for armed men. Let's see, where is she? Oh, this is where a fighting club is. Cute. Wait, where's the person I need to talk to? It says she's over here. On your way. Where's the patron? They're all peasants. I don't want to talk to peasants. Armor's wife. There's a blacksmith. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna have to wait. Ooh. That didn't sound healthy at all. <laughs> that didn't sound healthy at all. Swamp lands. Kind of reminds you of a prettier Florida. That's what it reminds me of. This is a prettier Florida. <laughs> and Florida has its pretty moments here and there. But it ain't not a bayou. <laughs> it's bayou's a bayou. Thing is, I haven't really been too deep in Florida's bayou before, but I have been to the bayou 
I just haven't went in deep enough to consider actually being within it. I think I've only been on the outskirts. It's a shame. It's a shame, indeed. Alright, so we're gonna talk to the contract issuer, which might probably just be in here. Contract issuer shouldn't be too far away. <laughs> Seems like it's just I have to go around this moat. Like it's near the uh Cro Crozai. Come on, just have to cross this and we're good. Excuse me. guy should have more cards though. Spot a cider for you? Or a bit of dry curd? Me lad, it's not exactly burst him, but what I got sure to please. We already played him and Gwent and beat him. Like to take a look. Alright. Oh, do I not have stuff equipped in? One second. Farewell. Must have the wrong stuff equipped. It must have did that to me after a certain mission. Oh yeah, because it was the Scoyatel stuff that was uh, messing me up. Mm, inventory. He equipped me with the wrong weapons. There we go. At least one of the wrong weapons. <laughs> A lot of stuff to sell though. What about these breaches? Nope, not as good. That's good enough for me then. Uh, yes, cool. Bestiary stuff has been updated. For you, or a bit of dry curd. Me lad, it's not exactly burst him, but what I got sure to please. Like to take a look. Hmm. Let's see. Okay, I've already have this item, which is nice. At least it tells me. Is there anything I can buy from him? Water. Hmm. Those oils might be in hand. Might come in handy. And I'll buy that water too. Sell him some of the stuff I don't need. There's the quest giver too. Nice. Shit. Chet. Greetings. Shit. Shit. Yeah. Shit. Shit. Or chat. 
Heard you have a problem. The monster you call a Shrieker. Aye. Prowls about, it does. Snatches cows and goats, mostly. But it won't scorn a man if it runs into one. The cartridges. Cartr huntsman under the old lord. Well, he said enough's enough. Claimed he'd put a stop to it. Drive the beast away. Mm -hmm. Took a hatchet. Need an ambush for the Shrieker beyond the moat. Where the fields start. It's where we found him. Guts stretched over the crown of a tree like gossamer. Took half a day to collect the parts. Put him in a grave. High time a professional took a look at this shrieker. Anyone around here know more about the beast? Borzoi's son Simcoe does. Saw the aura with his own eyes. But might find the lad art to chat with. Still mourns his father, methinks. I see. Where'll I find him? At my homestead. I took the tyke in when he lost his dad. The mother passed long ago. Thank you, sir. Let's talk to the boy. <clears throat> father but to do that I gotta know what killed him Shrieker killed him don't you know that name doesn't mean much to me describe the beast tell me what it looked like something like a rooster yep cockatrice but huge with a lizard's tail I heard Ruffler barking in the woods ran to see what you were on about there were dad in the bushes a hole through his belly Anywhere. Moaning, screaming. I wanted to help, but how could I? How? Shush now, calm. 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 Take care, kid. Poor kids, this uh, in shock. <laughs> Sometimes I don't mind using that. How is it? Axie. Sometimes I don't mind using it. Mainly just to help people. <laughs> no, no different than using a uh, medicine. It's just magic. This contract shouldn't be too far away. Let's see, do I have hybrid oil on me? Alright, check. So I think a cockatrice is hybrid. Let's go to glossary. First ones. Not elemental. Not that. Uh, it's probably not in my index right now because he hasn't said anything about it. Yeah, and it's definitely not a specter. But I think uh, I think a cockatrice is a hybrid. It's like a kind of like almost like a lizard, snake, rooster hybrid. I think it'll give me enough time to pre prepare for a cockatrice, though. There's the dog. Muzzles caked in blood. Didn't give up without a fight. Hmm. Tracks are irregular here. Monster must have started staggering. Was wounded, most likely. Blood. 
monster blood. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm, what's this? It's not a part of it. Hmm. Might want to look around some. Might as well look around this place, even though it's not a part of the thing I'm trying to do. You never know. Aha. Uh -huh. Come on. Come on. A diagram. Okay, back to what I was doing. <laughs> There's that blood trail. Tracks lead to the cave, the cockatrice. not a hybrid yeah so it is weak against Ard though and a grape shot anything I can use Ard when in doubt Ard it out hmm yeah I don't I think I have the oils to hmm. well, I can make that. I can make that. I don't have any concoctions to actually make any of the other stuff. Might as well make that. And I can make Dragon's Beam Dream. for the cockatrice so I'm just gonna have to use art and make sure I'm well prepared when it comes to being attacked Too quiet of a creature. Ooh. Sounds kind of. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, not about to leave. Bomb should smoke it out though. All right. Let's see if I have a bomb to flush this bitch out. hope I have a bomb. <laughs> Let's see, uh, inventory, I'll probably put it under a, I do, actually I kind of wonder, hybrid, cursed, 
But I do not have Draconis or oil. Damn. That's like she's some, uh... Actually, she's some stuff I don't have. Oh, I do have white honey potion. That's pretty good, just in case I'm about to, like... Let's see, grape shot is the one I need, but I don't think I have that. you do it. There we go. Here. Must have fled through another exit. Gotta nab it before it gets away. That scared it at least. And I need to use Ard, but I'm gonna probably put myself in Quen with there Ard. Is. Won't get away this time. Aha! There you are. Ah, that is. Come on, man. <laughs> on. Are you walking through the water? <laughs> You little bastard. Oh, knocked him out of the sky. Oop. Come on, come closer. Oof. If I can just get behind his wing, perfect. Got him. There we go. <laughs> Killed it. <sighs> There's the cockatrice. First of for probably many to come. So I remember the cockatrice pretty well. <laughs> this is a big old roostery. <laughs> Trophy for that does. Okay, let's see. Ten percent chance to dismember. Don't really care about that. I like that more. <laughs> I just like that more, man. Let's 
Speaking of my mutagens. Oh, not that. Character. Oh, cool. I can put something else here. I just don't know what. Hmm. Could probably put another green here and move my blue. Move my blue here. Get another green in. Heightened Tolerance, Poison Blade, Oil Applied Two Blades, 3% chance of poison, poisoner target on hit, Steady Aim, and Acquired Tolerance. Thinking the Poison Blade might work. There we go. Perfecto. Mm -hmm. All right. Now that we got that all situated. Turn back to town. My horse is pretty much ready for like one of the first few races anyway. Got some of those upgrades and everything. That thing. Shrieker won't trouble you anymore. Thank ye, Master Witcher. Your reward ain't much, but as they say, take care of the pennies. Keep the coin. You took in an orphan. Need it more than I do. And they call witches unfeeling, inhuman. Well, I thank ye from the bottom of my heart. No problem. Pay it forward and shit. Geralt. All right. Um. Go to request lock. Don't do any of these yet. Not the proper gear. None of those. Let's do this. It's only level six, so might as well. Yep. All right. Hey, yeah. Let's visit Kira Metz.
All right. Whoa. Lots of bears. Big old green aura. The rats, why did he need them? Bloody rodents. Better to have stuffed them with a poison or crushed them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Did you see what he did with them? <laughs> she saw me. <clears throat> Kira, what are you doing? Geralt, <laughs> you gave me quite a start. But nay, the mage says bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat dragged in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? Why do you want the lamp? You just witnessed why. To communicate with lost souls. Didn't know you were interested in that kind of magic. There's nothing wrong with it. Mm -hmm. Why'd the elf promise you the lamp? We traded for it. He needed powerful magic and sensed I was no common wart charmer. I brewed him a potion. To delay nervous tissue degeneration, stave off memory loss or some such. Who do you want to use it on? He didn't say. So, bet you saw this question coming. What are you doing here? Let me think. Enjoying the country air? Admiring the unspoilt scenery? Or is it furthering the age-old alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No, I'm in hiding, Geralt. Blind to the state of the world? Don't you see what's happening? I think mean, we've persecution already mages now face. Asked this. Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? Murderers scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. Picked a strange place to hide. I didn't pick anything. Everybody's in the north, about this stuff, men because... hunt sorceresses hmm. like fish in a barrel. Nilfgaard controls the south. Where was I to flee? Emperor does keep mages on a short leash, but he lets them live and ply their trade. Radovid and Emma differ in every respect except one. They share a deep hatred of the Lodge of Sorceresses. And I was a member. So how's it feel to be the village witch? Ah, horrid. No joy in having the boundless respect and trust of the local peasantry? <laughs> They'd respect anyone who could produce hemorrhoid cream. Been here a while, haven't you? Long enough for rot to set in. You cannot possibly imagine how much I detest this place. Yeah, we definitely heard this before. <laughs> Changing the subject. Mm. Mentioned you wanted something from me. I did. That was and weird. still do. The cursed isle on Lake Windama. You've heard of it, I'm sure. The local peasants mumble and so the rat about island it, about the wraiths that haunt it. They claim none who go there return. How'd it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. You've gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Pserad, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. <laughs> Why are you so intent on this? I'm not. The local peasantry is. The Isle Miss, you've got to lift the charm. You're a good witch, a great witch. There's no end to it. Uh -huh. See, I thought you didn't care for the locals. The great witch you are. I failed to lift the curse and they could conclude I'm not so great. Not enough to conceal me from the witch hunters and risk getting sent to the gallows themselves. What others think, your image, that's all you care about. The point is, listen, I didn't flee to these wilds just to stupidly get caught because some boar with grit under his fingernails grows annoyed with me. 
So the peasants who went to the island for food, this lord had them murdered? The villagers say he had them poisoned. A real gentleman. Hmm. Well, I never met him. But he certainly didn't seem such a cruel man, judging by what a mage from the isle told me. A mage lived on the island? Did you know him? Where is he now? We were friends. Sadly, he died that day as well. Very few survived. Hmm. Yet even those who escaped the isle soon suffered agonizing deaths. Strangely, they did not seem to have been poisoned. All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fike Isle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how, but they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course, provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. Yeah. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. Magic lamp. Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fikai once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Nice of you to send me there. I experienced <laughs> an acute nasal hemorrhage. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. At Aratusa, they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. <laughs> Take my boat. I left it on the lake shore near the village. Should be fit to use. Provided rot hasn't eaten it, as it seems to eat everything here. How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it, or do I have to do something uh, rub -a -dub -dub. magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, I suppose I should warn you. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Tell you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenovox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. <laughs> you will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. Never heard of a Xenovox. It works just like a megascope, but is far more portable. Think of it as a magic box that talks. They hard to build? Extremely. That's why they're so rare. I certainly couldn't build anything like it. So no chance these Xenovoxes will catch on with every mage using one? Not the slightest. <laughs> so where'd you get the Xenovox? Found it in the mine along with the lamp. Thought it was part of the lamp at first. Didn't realize what I'd actually found until later. Think it belonged to the elven mage? Clearly. And I didn't even know the elves used them. I need to know anything else before I go? No, that is all. Oh, go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Fi Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And... Geralt. Mm -hmm. Thank you. No problem. Got a new quest and everything like that. Sweet, 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 sweet. Mm, see if there's anything in your room that I might want. Of course, there's nothing to loot. <laughs> Geralt shall not take from a lady. A lady. But I will pick all this stuff. The storm, damn it. Yep, it's been storming quite a bit. Alright. <clears throat> Inventory. Let's go to here. Yep, Tower of Mice. So I'll do that one. 
Don't need Roach for this, so I guess Roach can stay on the mainland and I'll see if I can get to Fike Isle. I meditate first before I go there. Oh, nice. Hanging, dude. Hopefully, no drowners playing on dick me alive. You'll never take me alive, Jonners. <laughs> That's the intent. Okay, accelerate by holding down X. Yeah, there we go. We picked up steam. a nice bit. It's a nice. Scared the shit out of me. There. Don't do that. I shall contact you again soon. Wait, this Xenovox. Can I contact you with it or is it one way? One way only, I'm afraid. You'll have to trust my feminine intuition. Your what? My feminine intuition. Wonderful. Thanks, me lady. Don't leave me hanging. this bad boy. Geralt? Yeah. Are you on the aisle yet? Uh, Does the Xenobox work? Apparently. Can you hear me? What? I can't uh, hear. One second. Great broke. Got rock feed. No fucking kidding. There's neck of files. Bastards are everywhere. Who the hell screaming? Well, seriously, who's screaming? <laughs> Damn. There not be a siren nearby. Rot fiends. <sighs> so was there any Oh I hear it again. It's over there. Let's see if there's anything at the end of this. Oh there is. Aha! Relic oil. Got a new oil. What you gonna do, drowner? Hmm. 
So lots of drowners near the area too. Stuff in here. Mushrooms underneath the water. Oh, more drowners. Stench. The ghouls. And he came out of there. Hmm. Yeah, I should have necrophage oil. Probably apply that. Alright, so then. Most likely going to be dealing with necrophages and maybe specters. Some type of cursed ones. Let's see. Hybrid necrophage. Most likely going to have to clear this out. Feeding on all the dead ones. There we go. Another one. Come on, come closer. They are definitely attracted to dead bodies. That's anything to say. Hmm. Let's see if there's anything within. Oh. Hmm. A fresh corpse. It must have come here a while after the nobleman's death. Hmm. Wanted to see if there's anything to loot. Poor fool. Only he knew. Something on the pier. Spirit. Houses are practically sunken in. Nice.
I think I'll find more evidence across this area, I think. fast travel area. Nice. I can fast travel to Mike Island. I'm definitely gonna have to take care of these guys first. Oh, that is a... That's a water hag. Shit. Oh. I still have that oil one? Damn. Destroyed her. I think the oil was still active. At least how fast it took. No. Oops. The hell? Am I bleeding? Weird. Ah, uh, here we go. I wonder what led them here. Hunger or greed? Hmm, a very good questions indeed. I have to use the lamp. All right. Um, where is that lamp to the begin with? Hey, Bevo. I think the lamp is in quest items. I know the Xenovoxes. Hmm. It's definitely not under crafting and alchemy. I will go through all that. <laughs> hey, I got mistletoe. Boop, 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 boop. Well, if you want to check your booty bumps, it's under the Streamlabs extension. Or, uh, I forgot what you call it. If you're on your phone, you go to the extension tab. And if you're on the desktop, you just hover your mouse over and click on Suki and you'll get your numbers. Doop, doop. Let's do... Mm -mm. Trying to remember where the damn lamp is. Where is that? Oh, is it already equipped? Oh, the magic lamp is already equipped. Okay. So... Shall be using... The magic lamp. Peasants didn't come here to ask nicely. No, they did not. Mm. Let's try Kira's lamp. The place is full of rats, as many dead as alive. I think they're feeding on. <laughs> what? Whoa. Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. Sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. Where's that noble? Okay. Where's that noble? Let's see if we can get the full picture. Lying here, quiet. Damn it. Come on. Where's that noble? There we go. We got the full picture. Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. 
sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. He's not the end of it. Sons can suffer for him. <laughs> Drink a stout. To the Shit. Top. Yeah, so they went up top. Man, I should have not drank that stout. Blood. Many must have died here. Something's knocking on this door. Or nothing was knocking on the door. Hmm. There's nothing on the other side. Unless it's a ghost. Oh. That's not weird at all. Let's see. Something over here. Rich folk. That will ever understand them. Keeping rats in cages like rabbits. Let them out, maybe. Like to die of hunger if we leave them there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Really? Oh. In the... Rich folk. That will ever understand them. Keeping rats in cages like rabbits. Let them out, maybe. Like to die of hunger if we leave them there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Releasing is not like to bring no good. Imagine the harm they'd do if they swam back to the village. Swam? Rats? How do you figure they'd do that? Oh, rats do swim. Fret for them. Clever little bastards. Clever in you. Hmm. They seem sluggish to you. Got the mange, maybe? Oh, and that stench. Yeah, they shouldn't have went down there. Should have not went down there, you idiots. We'll take that stuff, though. Pure silver. Vela Longsword. I think we're pretty much good down here, though. Yep. <clears throat> this is time to go up, upstairs. Upstairs, upstairs. Let's see if there's a. Uh, uh, or if it's locked on the other side. Mm <laughs> hmm. Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'll not hear of them again. That simpleton turned your head. But one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly, one and all. My lord, peasants, they're through the door in the tower. Hmm. Well, they fucked up the place, too. Uh... I don't know if that was the guy that called for the Lord. He died with him. A couple bodies in here. Let's see, and that's the door I came through. Means they chased some more people upstairs. Go. Or if she went back upstairs. That was something over here, though. Gold! Piles of it! Oh, won't do the dead any good now, will it? Strange is still here. The noble died a time ago. Who's that? Show yourself. Anyone there? Who? Who are you? Hmm. Wonder what attacked him, Pia Wraith. Spectre of sorts. Exploding bolt. Yay. Ooh, what was that? Hmm. Maybe I should get my spectre oil out. 
I have a feeling there's definitely going to be a specter in here. Just in case. Anything outside? Anyone that was might have been talking. Lots of uh, lots of rats arenas though. Extinguish. Guess I don't have to read that note. If there's anything on it? No notes to read. Oh, did you like that? I didn't like that. Hey, is that a new crossbow? Oh. Ooh, that creaking. I'm at the top. Nothing mm -hmm. here that looks like a dragged something across Oops. the floor. More dragged it from one wall to the other repeatedly. Something to move. Let's see. Probably a switch. It's leather. Aha. I heard some crying. Well, let's see, can we can we light that? When in doubt, Igni. Oh, whoops, too close. Igni. No, can't light it. I tried my best. Hmm. Looks like a laboratory. Definitely. That's uh, over here. Yep. Yeah. Fucking wraith. Why did you leave? You claim to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? Hmm. I'm a witcher. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. Oops. My family and I, we hid in the Mage's Tower to await the war's end, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. Mage who lived here, who was he? Alexander? I hardly knew him. He spent most of his time locked away in this tower. He's dead too, you know. They're all dead. Mountains of corpses, yet I stand here alone, all alone. They've all abandoned me. Even he who promised me everlasting love. You will abandon me as well. If I can lift the curse, you yourself will be free to leave. Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No. They came to rob and kill. They thought us rich, believed we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. What kind of potion was it? Remember its smell? 
what it looked like. I remember only that I feared to drink it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed he meddled in disease. Not killing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumors, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him. My beloved Graham. He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and... Your beloved failed to save you. Why? There were too many. Leave her be, he shouted. He grabbed at them, tried to stop them. They just laughed. Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms, tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... nothing. Poisoned? That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone, it was dark. Only there were rats. Everywhere. Dozens. Hundreds. And I... couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere. All over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Have I not suffered enough? Why can't I leave this place? You weren't the last to die on this island. Found a fresh corpse in the tower. The island's a dangerous place. Folks should not venture here. I too wish to leave. The dead man. Looked like a monster had attacked him, recently. The tower home to anything else? How am I to know? There's lots of wraiths here. I, I, I hear them whispering every night. Not talking about ghosts. A monster who hunts here. You must have noticed something. I don't know. I've noticed naught. Why do you ask? Why must you press me so? You're to be my savior, not my tormentor. Can you talk to the island's other specters? No, I'm alone here. The others, they flee when they see me. I know not why. You do not fear me, do you? No. Used to dealing with ghosts. Though, gotta admit, there's something about you. You're... different. How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it, but who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Grail. No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. Your beloved, who is he? A noble son? No, a poor fisherman. My father objected, strongly. He did not see us together. I miss him so. Each night I walk to the island shore to gaze upon the village. Does he remember me still? Hmm. Said before you can't leave the tower. Did I? You must have. Uh. I don't think There's so. holes in your story, lady. I... I don't know anymore. It's all a nightmare to me. I have a feeling you're lying, bitch. <laughs> As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the Isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land, the base of the curse, that is. If so, forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest should lift it. I... loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. 
Take my bones to him. He must bury them. This will be our farewell. Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Hmm. I need to look around first. Really hope I can help. Need to look around first. Whatever for? Not in the tower, but bones and rats. Don't leave me with them again. I'll come back for you. You can be sure. Very well, but come back soon. Don't keep me waiting. I need to get a little bit more information. Let's see. Alone. All have left me. What's this? Experimenting on humans. Never would have gotten away with it if the Conclave were still in charge. When will this nightmare end? Any scripts. Let's see. Go upstairs Alone. a little bit more. All have left me. Who the fuck put him in here? So those are... They look fresh. They're like new people. Even though they were probably kept in there for quite a while, they... Don't look rotted. <sighs> Something is going on that doesn't seem quite right. East oil. Wait a minute. Let's just go further out. Uh huh. Uh. I shouldn't walk too further. <laughs> too much. Far. Doesn't really go anywhere. Just wanted to see. Okay. We got a little bit more evidence of some foul play going on. About the dead people upstairs. When will this nightmare end? Talk to Annabelle in a second. There's still some ghost I need to look for. I didn't see any ghosts here. Just doing some investigation, that's all. checked out here Still locked. I did check everything uh, in the basement area or ground level. 
think, but we're just going to double check just to make sure. Yeah, it looks good. Hmm. No other specters around here. Now it's time for me to guess there might be a specter or something like that. Maybe outside the place, since the circle is pretty big. Locked. What's with the door? You wish to leave. That's all you did. What do you want? No more lies. No more deceit. Uh. You will stay here for all time. You will never. <sighs> the bitch did it. The bitch finally did it. Where she go? Oh, fall. What? Wait. What? Ah, damn it. It's all locked. Let's see. Maybe our. Aha! A bit. Looks like I need to get her beloved to the island. Fisherman named Graham. I know the man. He lives in Oriton, village on the lakeshore. Find him immediately. We're close to unraveling this. I can feel it. Uh huh. First things first. I want to complete the optional shit. I think there's one here. Nope, oh, that is not an optional. <laughs> Stuff from here. Hmm. There we go. <laughs> Got rid of that. The Zigni on this too. Hi. 
What a... Not much. How's it going? Oh, well. I got a call for another interview. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Getting all them interviews. Yeah, seriously. Big sky. Ah. So, I try to go up there tomorrow afternoon after I have some training tomorrow at Albuquerque. Cuckoo. Figure out. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Flowers getting popular. <laughs> <laughs> Put in all these applications because no one was calling me, and all, all of a sudden, in a couple of days, I have three people wanting interviews. <laughs> I'm just gonna cancel them. Yeah. That's just. I'm not yeah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Do do do. Okay, let's put some necrophage oil on. Not that. Quinn. These assholes love to hit you. How you like that silver? There we go. Perfect. Hmm. They must have been attracted to it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Says use the magic lamp to find ghosts. Thing is, I think we used it on pretty much all the area. Well, at least there's no fast way to find it. This area that they want me to cover is huge. Go over here, maybe. See if there's anything up here, ghost wise. I'm not seeing it. I think that all the specter stuff is within, out, inside the area. Oh, this is Millie, ghost we stuff. Flee. Quick now, Millie. B Millie, what's with you? I don't know. So up, burning. Ah. What? No. No, stay back! Don't leave me! 
Hmm. All right. So find the green little plumes. At least outside. So I think I know where another one is. Oh wait, what was that? Oh, a crow's eye. Might need that for a potion. Alright, I think there was one out here somewhere, because I don't think I've seen one over there. That there are like gas bubbles. No. There's one over here. They're on to us! They'll not let Graham in! Quiet, fool. Babylon and the noble himself will hear you. Nah, he sat his arse on silk pillows, likely be gobbling meat. <laughs> We've no notion we he's coming to tear him to shreds. Waste clear, lads. Adam! Hmm. So I do want to finish this optional stuff first. Uh, should I drink that meat stout? Okay, I don't see any others over here. There might be one near the other rot fiends I've fought. Oh, there's one. They left us! Look! All of them done went! We've to swim, come on! What about all this? I can't leave it! You go! Find a boat and come back for me. If you make it across. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? Be back before you know it. Thing is, the guy didn't think about like what's actually in the water. All right, let's talk to Graham. See if we can get Graham. Let's see, I parked my boat somewhere further down, but oh, there's a boat right here that's not being used. So I shall use this boat. Uh, first things first, though. Come on. Some rot fiends to take care of. Ah! Oh shit! I want to get caught. stuff and then head to shore there we go take helm Drink a little bit. <laughs> Nothing wrong with drinking and selling. It's not like you have to steer a boat in a straight line. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, he's like literally right across the shore. <laughs> How does he live with himself? Uh, let's park the boat right here. And jump it off. following me 
Just wondering what you want from him, from Graham. Me? Didn't want nothing. It's his mother be worried about him. Been locked in his hut since he came back from the Isle. Talks to no soul. Love's misery curdled his brains, I reckon. <laughs> I won't be as cocky once the Baron's men whip your arse. Do, 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 do. Talk to him. I want to talk. You death, damn it. I told you. Who are you? I'm a witcher. What of it? Where should I care? I've been to the island. I know what happened there. What do you want of me? Want to talk to you about Annabelle. Annabelle? What can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through. Believed we'd be together. Of course, it was not to her father's liking. His daughter and a plain lout. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. It were Millie, Finch and Faulkner. They rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle, take back what was ours from the noble. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me as soon as I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it, for Annabelle and me to flee. But it all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape. First, then she drank the poison. The mage must have gave her. I ran out the tower hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. Said you were hollering as you fled the tower, the island. What exactly did you say? I don't remember. I wanted them to pay for what they'd done to her. Might have cursed them. There's a powerful magic aura on Fike Isle. Passions, evil intent, strong emotions of any kind can activate it. Your words could be the curse's source. She took the poison because of them. It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. But that means is she You said you spoke to her. Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, Tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. She was... She was alive the whole time. But... Can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged her, open your eyes. I never thought... It's not your fault. No guilt in not knowing. And you couldn't know it wasn't poison she drank. Gods, what have I done? If I had to stay behind to bury her... I didn't notice she was alive. It might have ended different, ended well. If you'd stayed on the island, I doubt you'd have survived. I'd take death over leaving her to the rats like that. But there's naught I can do about it now. Wrong on that count. Annabelle needs you. You can help her. She's still there. In the tower. Can I see her? Yeah. One thing you should know, though. In death, Annabelle turned into a pester. A pester? What's that? More than a restless ghost. A plague maiden. A powerful wraith filled with grief and hatred that drive her. Give her the power to sow disease and death. She suffers. How am I to help her? Gods know I'm willing. Annabelle thinks you abandoned her. Gods! She... 
hates me. And all this time she's thought I ran, abandoned her. Yes, go to the tower, talk to her. Maybe you can convince her that's not how it was. I thought she died. I'd never have left her there otherwise. A curse has imprisoned Annabelle and the other spirits on the island. Love can shatter its power, free her, and them. Just as in the legends. If you know the legends, you know one kiss is enough to break an evil spell. On one condition. That it's a kiss from someone whose love is true. I told you. I said I love her with all my heart. Take me to her, please. It's dangerous. There are risks involved. Understand that, don't you? Of course. I'm no coward. I'll not run this time. Nothing. Let's go. I'm ready. All right. Let's do this one. Let's go to the tower. Okay. Might need to get ready to handle the specter. Maybe I don't need the lamp anymore. It weren't impossible. We could have been together, and now she's dead. And it's my fault. If only I'd been able to protect her. Can't change the past, but you can still help Oop, Annabelle. That was a liquor. To rest in peace. If I have to fight specters while I'm drunk, <laughs> it's gonna be weird. It's terrifying. It's too quiet. Chop, chop. Speed up. Let's get this over with. I remember the screams. Inhuman they were. Now it's silent. They're dead. All dead. Don't think about that. Keep walking. Hurry your ass up. I don't got all day. Got other witcher in to do. You kiss that, which has no lips. Oh, it's changed.
Hmm. The curse is lifted, and Graham and Annabella are reunited. I don't think there's ever a way to really save that guy, though. You can probably tell. Well, yeah, there's no way to actually lift the curse without them, those two meeting afterwards. So I don't know. All right, let's get out of the tower. I have no business being here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Yoink! I drink some booze after that one. That kind of hurt. I <laughs> can see straight. Oh, one second. Let's take that Spectre stuff. It might be useful. Alrighty then. Now it's time to get back to Kira. Hmm. Let's see, is there a quick travel area that I could go to? Yes, there is. I'm gonna go over here and take that notice board. Get some more witcher quests. Should be good. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Hmm. Don't steal our youngins. Uh, I don't think I have any need for something like that. Let's talk. Uh, talk to the blacksmith. Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of mess with things. All right. Let me see what you're offering. Let's watch a boy in. Hmm. I should probably read that stuff too. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. We'll need those. You need of these. Don't need that, that, or that. Oh, it's broke. Mm, won't be broke for long. Let's see. Anything that I can buy from him that I might need in the future. Hmm. One of those repair kits would be nice. Thank you. My overall repair stuff is uh waning. Waning steel swords. Any better steel swords I can make? Ooh, ooh, I could make that one. But it's not a giant jump. That's about it. Let's repair the stuff I have equipped. Farewell. So long. Hmm. Go to my alchemy real quickly. And do beast oil. 
Sectoid oil. Can make a new potion. Oh, that refers to concoction. Almost like an insta hill. <laughs> Cockatrice to concoction. Hmm. All right. Someone has the hiccups. Drinking the burrs. make it look like I have a uh, really shiny boots <laughs> oh trader greetings what do you have wouldn't mind a look at your stock mm. oh if I need any of this I definitely need to meditate though. Pretty shiny boots. When I like when I walk by the girls like, ah, it's too bright. <laughs> Farewell. Oh no. My god, Becky, look at those boats. I just wear these boots to impress uh, Akira. <laughs> That's all. There's no practicality in them. <laughs> it's here to blind all the babes and fell in. Yeah, this place might smell like piss and shit, but man, do the girls have the curves. <laughs> dead bodies nearby well doesn't help that there's trees that have hanging bodies in them. <laughs> doesn't help so many dead people in Velen Velen just kind of sucks <laughs> this is so much death Excuse me, my yawning is obnoxious. Wolf's bane. All right, Kira, I did the thing. You better be happy about it. Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. All right. Uh, let's do this one. Fike Isles free of its curse. Able to persuade Graham to go to the tower with you? Did you mention there was a pastor involved? He knew the risks, but he'd also heard lots of stories about true love, whose kiss can break any spell. Can't help thinking that gave him courage. And? It ended well? Depends how you look at it. Curse is lifted, Annabelle's spirit is left in peace. But Graham's dead. Oh, poor boy. Still. He's proved that true love may be more common than some suppose. The lamp. What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the eye has been cleansed. 
Might need it for something else. Going there with you. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. Oh. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You knew this? All the mages knew about it. Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes, but he guarded them jealously. All right. Time I was on my way. Perhaps, perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer? Oh. There's one small favor you might yet do for me. Marinate what in your butter. It? I put in an order for a few substances from Novograd. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Did you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. <sighs> Fine. Why not? If he was coming here from Novograd, he must have passed through Black Bell. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. I do this one errand for fine. Excuse me, lady. Favor for a friend. What is this level? How? Oh, it's just level six. Right. Cool. Nothing too bad. I was gonna see ride Roach. Oh wait. Ask a service oh. of the Witcher, the Pella must. A witcherly service, that's to say. What do you need? Tell me. A man who fears no evil, the Pella needs. Forefather's Eve is nigh. We've rights to conduct. Wandering souls to emerge. Damned souls, too. We've the circle to protect from these wretches. What'll I get out of it? Witches do naught for free. This the Pella knows. Not to fear. How to reward one for their aid. This too the Pella knows. Why hold the ritual at all? At times men die choking with regret. At times death takes them before they've tasted any bitterness in life. These poor souls, unfulfilled, cannot leave this veil of tears. Their spirits wander midst the living, must be judged, sent on their way. This we do. On Forefather's Eve. Seems like you could use a Witcher. So yeah, I'll help. You'd not refuse. The Pell on you. The time's come to gather the folk. Across the lake we must journey. To Fike Isle. There in the Circle of Stones we shall meet. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight at midnight. What's the difficulty of this one? Oh, I can do it. Okay, uh, I guess I'm going to fight Kyle. Move it. Guess that little uh, arrangement I have with uh, Kira is gonna have to wait. What is a horse doing? Boots and hats and boots and hats and boots and hats and boots and hats. Here I can just fast travel to Fike Isle. So we're probably gonna have to deal with specters in Fike Isle, so let's uh get our oils and all that done. All that did. I'm also gonna try and do a little bit of meditation so I can get my concoctions and all that you know, rebrewed and stuff. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Yeah. Meditation. That's about a little bit. That should be good.
Mm. Won't coat my sword just yet. I might run into some necrophages here. They've been popping up like weeds. Should be good to put in that oil. Spectre oil. Oh, it's still coated in some oil. Very good. Yadden. Quen. Pop Quen first. Let's start to talk to the Peller. I'll be back. Oh, yeah, we gotta... Meditate until the appropriate time. I think 12? Greetings. Just in time. Good folk. Behold the one who will protect us. You needn't fear. Soon shall we summon the wandering souls. Beyond all help, some will be. From these, you must protect us. Evil creatures keep at bay. Keep at bay till the ritual's done. Okay, let's get started. <clears throat> Begin. Keep us from harm and let them not disturb the circle. What is this life? Well, you know. Let him torment there we go. What comes next once life subsides? Mine is all fate decides. Soon will rise thy dead, thy buried. Each will say by what thou hurried. Will ye grant these souls reprieve? The storm Let's begin for Father's Eve. Ye who want oh, we got drowners. Ever caught in this world's thrall, see this sign. Oh, and hags. Ye we summon, ye we call. Ye we summon. Fucking hang. I was expecting specters. <laughs> Hark, a sound I hear. Tis right. A spirit breaks the still of night. Burn the incense ever higher. Spirit, join us round the fire. Spirit, speak. This time is yours. Tell us of your ghostly woes. Who are you? He knows. Hmm. Should I drive him away? No. I've come for you, Patricide. Be gone, foul force. I cast upon you the light of the eternal fire. Abomination! Stop this at once! The errant souls! We must help them! Silence! I'll not tolerate necromancy! Help me! This isn't necromancy. Leave 
now. You're disrupting the ritual. This is black magic. These folk disturb the dead. We cannot allow it. We will not. You don't know a thing about their customs. Take you and disperse the others. Good folk, leave not these grounds. You cannot break the circle. Nice, help me out. Blood has stained the hallowed ground. Shit, it's tainted. Yep, we cannot stop what has begun. The bloodshed, it do any harm. Tainted lies the circle now. They who thirst for the gore of men shall come. God's willing, they will be few, and the Pella shall finish the right. If you want to continue, I'm ready. Good folk, yeah, this is getting uh, Prepare yourselves. It's gonna get worse. <laughs> ye we summon, ye we call, and to souls we'll judge ye all. All is quiet. Something whispers, something peeps. Someone near our fire creeps. All is quiet. All is quiet. Wraiths! This sacred ground is with blood stained. We cannot the ritual complete. People, save yourselves. If your lives you value, run. Hmm. Oh shit. At least give me some time. lost hmm, gotta be a peasant who told the witch hunters about the ritual that spirit they drove away your father's ghost right threatened to come back likely to keep his word old man ambros the pillar fears not that wraith called you a patricide he get it right Aye. if i'm gonna help you i gotta know everything why'd you kill your father the pillar does not wish to speak of this you can't hope to manage this alone. You're afraid, that's clear. Wraith will hold sway over you. Listen, I'll send him off. I've got to. But I need to know where he's buried. Corpse probably hasn't turned to dust yet. That's his bond to the world of the living. Ambrose lies in the swamp. Fine, I'll find his body, see what I can do. So much, so much shit. Master items, or magic items. I get that wraith essence. It's clearing up. Right. Mm. Okay, I'll do some fast traveling. think I've been over here. Uh, the best place that I can travel to looks to be Burn 
Yeah, burnt runes. I'll travel over there, and then we'll just go on horse the rest of the way. See if we can pick up some missions in between. I do need to pick up uh, the rest of those missions anyway. <laughs> All right. There's Roach. Chasing me. Oh, it's level 5 wolf. That's it. Alright. Don't have time for you to get lost. Let's see. I don't think this is the town I've been through, so. Like if this has a notice board or something like that, I definitely need to pick it up. And yep, we got some new missions to do. Slower. And a fight club. I'll do the fight clubs eventually. to pick up the rest of those notice boards so I can get pretty much a good amount of the uh, quest I can do. Actually, have I leveled up any? Been paying attention. It's like I'm a level 9 right now. Yeah, there's a point I can spend. <laughs> um, Let's see. Planning to upgrade Poison Blade. Oh, wait. There we go. That way we can have a bit of a better boost. Whoa there, Roach. Probably go a little faster. Seems pretty quiet in the woods, which is actually not a good thing. Hmm. Not one step closer. Whoa. With the other Who the hell's this? Bad leaders. Well, that is true. In the game, we do. Fuck the wishes. <laughs> well, let's loot the looters. Faster, excuse me, deer. Good old deer. Whoa. Hmm. 
Why not be a safe four horse? So I'm gonna leave you up here, Roach. Yeah, definitely not a safe four horse. Oh, injuring the horses. We shall not injure Roach. Get some necrophage oil. Quinn. Turn again. Didn't know if the specter was gonna attack me or not. <laughs> well, I think while I'm over here, I should try and find uh hmm. Oh, there is a quest over here. Oh, totally didn't notice a tree over there. I forgot there's like a giant tree on the mountain. Vossazos, Foglets. A monster prowls the bog. Enter the mist and you'll never see home again. This monster, tell me more. Only seen it once myself, and that from afar and past dusk. Thought it were a man at first. Then it turned, and I saw eyes burning like coals and a jaw full of fangs, one next to the other. Humanoid, nocturnal. Hmm. First attack. Remember when it happened? A week passed, near about. It was then Boren vanished. Merrick and Tommel went looking for him, didn't come back either, them two. I were feared. Now none dare venture into the bog. Camp stands deserted, and the peat there, master, it's the best sort. Black as pitch and oily. Good for fuel and... Fascinating, but staying with the topic at hand. I can help. For a fee. Course! Why, even an ox don't pull a plow for free. <laughs> Alright, time I got to work. Where'll I find this monster? Start south of here. But beware, bad poxy air hangs o'er the marsh. Stings your eyes, claws at your throat. Claws so hard you could choke. Swamp Thing. <laughs> I like the title of it. That's a level 12 mission. Could still do it, but... Let's see... Poor Father's Eve is the one I was on. We'll continue that one. Mm hmm. Okay. So I can receive some quests from here, so go over there. I will deal with the swamp thing later. Most likely a foglet. Or a group of foglets. Oh, there's Drowner. Multiple drowners. And then, where are you going, drowner? 
And dead. These guys didn't drop a lot. Monster teeth. That's it. <laughs> Damn it. Can't get past a tree. Uh oh, I know where we are. This is where we're going to find the witches. They're not supposed to be here yet. That's why there's so many drowners here. Come on, come on. Definitely wishes protection. Yeah, because I think those flowers and all that are safe passage. You're gonna be constantly getting attacked. You're not near the flowers. Most likely a foglet's over here. But look, I'm just here to get some damn. What do you call it? Quest. <laughs> here to get some contracts. Here we go. Yeah, this is the town I've been trying to get to. Hey, Goose. Man, I want to play that Untitled Goose game. <laughs> Looks fun. Speaking of Goose. Straight from the coop, there a trace of shit on them. Show me what you sell. Show me what you're pointing. Ah, it doesn't. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Hmm. What else you're pointing? Might as well just sell these. <laughs> sell this stuff. I can I actually... Eh, I'm gonna keep the Vox. Sell that. Too bad you can't actually use the fishing rods. <laughs> Too bad indeed. All right, should be good. Mm. So long. Play uh, play Gwentens in a bit. Still just trying to get all these uh, quests packed up and ready to go. Hmm. So many question marks. 
Yeah, I should be able to fast travel to... Is there a question mark in your crow's perch? Hmm. Well... Hmm. <laughs> Why are you up there? Come on. Get up on... Get up on him. Please move. All right. Ooh, there. All right. This place sucks. Uh, is that those? Those are harpies. Hey, stop it. And is that a cockroach? No, that is a. What is that? I am in a really shitty location. <sighs> oh. I don't know what that is. Is that cockroaches? Uh, come on. We need her to go. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know what level it is. Oof. Say like harpies were just next to it too and everything? Hmm. I have a feeling it's most likely a part of a mission. Don't tackle it just yet. Hmm, I think these woods are pretty familiar too. Abandoned, abandoned campsite. Whoa! Guarded treasure, guarded by what? Ooh, level 12 bear. Ooh, let's not say we did. <laughs> we'll come back to that later. level 9 with no upgraded gear for a while <laughs> we might be able to take that bear but I like to be prepared prepare yourself foul fiend okay possibly fast travel here Sorry, people. Slower. Mm. All right. Looks like I need a. Ooh, there. Sorry. Didn't know that was gonna spook my horse. Mm. Yeah, let's travel to Crow's Perch and see what that mission is. Hmm. Yeah, the Peller has a dark past, dark history. Hmm. Yeah, it should be just down there. Oh, this fucker. You, I challenge you. Boots a bit big, maybe. Careful not to trip. Halt, I say. I am Ronvid of the Small Marsh, bound by a sacred oath. Oh, that's rough. My sympathies. To honor made Bilbury, fairest of all maids I know, by dueling a hundred knights to the death. Now, draw your sword post haste. But I have nights in on left after you. You're gonna choose a witcher for your first? Hmm. Why are you challenging me? Don't recall doing anything to offend the maid Bilberry. Well, uh, why? 
Um, Red Sway. Sway made Bill Bruce the most loveliest of all. Yes, he is. I've never laid eyes on her. Aha! Ah, I shall wash your scorn away with thy blood fiend. Stand and fight. Ah, oh, you dumbass. Ow. Come on, dude. You know, <laughs> I yield. Yeah, you better yield. <laughs> dumbass. Bad enough. Yes. Look stood with you. But but the next time we meet. Go back to mate Billberry and apologize for being an ass. <laughs> Quick, before I change my mind and break your bones. We shall meet again. Stop making her look like an ass. <laughs> So what you're doing it doesn't make anything better <laughs> all right roach where are you <laughs> excuse my yawning Correctly, the peller doesn't live too far away from this place. Hey, he did a fart just like you did. <laughs> Taking a piss. Yeah, it seems like. <laughs> Alright. Got about eight, 80 paces. Or well, not 80 paces, but uh. I'm trying to remember what that yard uh, measurement is. I'm thinking that's yards, probably. Yeah, it's probably yardage. The numbers, anyway. Alright, Peller. Talk about your dead father. Wise wolf. What is it the wolf needs? Folk from the village come here often? Oh, when help they need, the peller they seek. Help with what? With the dead that come a-haunting. Peace must be made. But they must then wait for forefather's eve. Or when an evil spirit runs wild in a homestead. Drive oh. the spirit off. Is that what, is that what happened? Need, say, a love potion. Then to the witch you would be sent. Not a matter for the Pella, that. Also, you should really speak with more context, uh, zombie. Found your father's Lead into certain conversations with it. me did. being very confused. Return for me, ye would have. Yeah, I'm going to have to disable it myself. What's your story? You actually kill your father? It was an evil man. The Pella feared him once, but then yep. he grew brave. You can. What his father did to his mother, the Pella could not look upon it. So he split yeah, I think it's under community gifting. Yeah, Left stop collecting the gifts. But folk, there we go. Turned it off. Goes but I really shouldn't do that while I'm streaming, though. A reward for your eyes. I'm going to try and avoid doing that type of stuff while I'm trying to stream. Deters away from the actual game. That's alright, I needed to fix it anyway. Especially if it's been going on the whole entire time I've been streaming. It's a kind of a problem. <laughs> eh, that fixed it though. It's all good. It's all behind it. All right, let's do this one more quest and we'll probably take a break. 
getting a little, what do you call it? Getting huh? A little bit uh, not not hungry. What is it? Got the munchies. <laughs> Um, there was a Is it a main quest? Where Hmm, it's not a main quest. What was the other There's a certain quest I'm trying to do. I don't think it's any of these. Is it that one? No. Not that one. Oh, favor for a friend. That's the one I'm trying to do. Alright, Roach. Where are you? Roach, why are you way down there? Bad Roach. What are you, what are you doing down there? Mating with all the deer. Stop! Stop! Stop mating with all the deer. I don't think you guys can crossbreed. <laughs> Ooh, lots of wild dogs. Hey, don't attack, roach. Oh, well, that's something I can do. Oh, we're gonna, about to get a giant fight on our hands. <laughs> Necrophages and wild dogs. Lots of dead bodies. And bodies becoming re dead. for that. Whoa. Any of that better? I hope so. Nope. Better boots as long as I repair. And that's about it. Oh well. Hmm. Favor for a friend. Ah, uh, damn necrophages. Stop it. Water hags. And more. Water hags, they just throw shit at you. And they hit hard. Come on. Oh, oh, killed both of them. Nice. <sighs> okay, can I like investigate now, please? Wide, heavy wheels, merchant's wagon. The bear hide. Hmm. 
Hmm. Went off road. Uh, I think I find. Nope, that's. Will got lost here. Still went going. Yeah, still going. Here's some insects, though. Yeah, merchant traveling across Velen alone. No way that was gonna end well. Package still intact. Got it. Don't sense anything magic, though. Wonder how Kira will explain this one. Human, from an artery. Can't be far. Wouldn't have made it. Hmm. Ah. Rough game. Come on, stay closer. Ew. Baby dead. Hmm. Ah, Hit. there he is. Waited for help. It never came. That's Velen for you. Missing merchant letter. Hmm. Leftovers, cuts of meat, cataplepus. Wonder what spell requires that. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Hmm. Level nine, so I should be able to do it. Might have some insectoid uh, oil as well. Unless I didn't make it yet. Nah, I did. Alright, here we go. Let's pick fights with insects. God, they hit hard though. That's why I like my exploding shell, though. Should be all of them. Haven't really killed any of these guys. Not that I know of. Did kill one insectoid creature, but... I don't think I killed these guys yet. Ooh, there's a warrior. That's a warrior! Oh yeah, he's looking to kill. I need to repair my sword again. <sighs> Let's see what's here. Some good stuff. Anything around this burnt house? Oh, just that stuff. Cool. Hmm. Well, a chance to stagger. I don't have anything to put it in. Oh. Can't have a better crossbow for now. Better gloves. 
that's about it. Ah, increase Quen. Thank you. Intensity of Quen has been increased. Also, do I have anything to repair the damn sword I'm using? Yes. Hmm. Bring some champagne. Well, come on. What are you doing? trouble. Ah, damn bandits. <laughs> Let's kill his uh, other dudes. Come on, come closer. Come on, asshole. Well, I know you have another friend. I guess that's gonna have to wait. Ah, uh, says horse. horse is now free. Free to do whatever it wants. Including mate with deer. <laughs> if it needs to. <laughs> hmm. Oh, and I also leveled up. I didn't notice that. Substances you wanted. Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But first, I'll brew yourself a mug of mulled wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. Care to tell me what you're up to? I would rather show you. But oh. you must wait a bit. Fine, I'll wait. Color me intrigued. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoo outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable? Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on, out. You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. <laughs> Three white mice. Huh? If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Are they the blind mice? Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. The cane then capable. Turn them into horses. Third mouse, what happened to it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So where did... Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A zoogle cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole, left behind one slipper, so... I beg you, not another <laughs> word about zoogles. Now, to return to the fairy tale, I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother, I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a prince charmer. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Velen. So, what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? Sure. I'm a witcher, not a gigolo. 
Don't flatter yourself. I don't want to shag you in the bushes, but to share a pleasant evening. But if no, then no. Oh, all right. I'll do it. I feel honored. Truly. Before we go, there's one more thing. Gonna transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Why not? Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gavella Glan. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair color while I was at it. I've always fancied dark-haired men. Oh well, any port in the storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Last one there does the dishes. Oh, uh, she's gonna race me? Hey, can't have that. real quick like I'm blocking her there we go Oh, there's a quest for me to do over there. At least I found it. Ta da! Well, this is quite nice. <laughs> Congratulations! You'd make an excellent jockey. If only I were a foot shorter and five stone lighter. Well, yes. But then I'd not have invited you here. Now do you see why I needed those substances? Beef and cinnamon and cloves, roasted capon with shallots. It was worth the trouble. Shall I pour the white or the... Dry red, but let it breathe a little first. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think witchers suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cock or gander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. How, if you don't mind my asking? I mean, you'd think the only work to be had in Velen would be in farming. <laughs> Very true. So, I've two options. I can either start cultivating turnips or leave. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first curse I've lifted. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. Didn't destroy that workshop if that's what you're asking. Didn't see any reason to. If Alexander's findings were to fall into the wrong hands. Although, Fikeyle has a terrible reputation. None even dare go there. Perhaps there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm sorry. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends. With benefits. Oh. So? Your fairy tale, your rules. Really? Then close your eyes and count to ten. One, two, three, four. All right, that's enough. 
Guess we're uh Kira, wanna play hide and seek? Why not? Let's see. Uh, follow the smell. A skirt. Guess we're playing hunt the hare, not hide and seek. <laughs> Good. Won't have to fumble with fasteners. Nice. Very nice. Hmm. Shame. Could have kept her shoes on. <laughs> he likes it with the shoes on. All right. I see where you're going, Geralt. <laughs> now, where's that Cinderella gone to? Hmm. Feeling she's gonna be over here. Found me. Congratulations. Do I get a prize? I have nothing on me. But I'll think of something. Call that constellation in Zeracania? Dragon something, I bet. <laughs> no, it has a different name. A bit indecent, actually. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. Egfain Nave. She does not care all out. And put his clothes back on. Where? Except for his gloves and boots. <laughs> put me to sleep with a spell. Means she's up to something. Hmm. I wonder what she did. Uh, I got the tower. Guess we're gonna have to go back over there. Hmm. Okay. Let's see what she did. Hmm. Why do I not have my <laughs> gloves and shoes on? It's this one that's better. And now I need gloves. Alright. Think we got everything? <laughs> okay. I need a boat, but who needs a boat when you can swim like a witcher? Eh, the isle's not that far away anyway. Not that far at all. I haven't dived under to see how deep it is. Eh, pretty deep. Not that deep. Nothing underneath either, so I'm, I think I'm safe to say that I don't have to worry about creatures underneath the water. Yeah, come on. Oh, looks like the necrophages are back in an slurry how long you gonna make that rock fans are here <laughs> yummy
Got some more ghouls or owl ghouls? Ghouls. Okay, that's not bad. For his owl ghouls, I would worry. Especially with that many. Take all the goodies. A light. Top floor of the tower. Mm, she's well she might have been up there. Do I have to go up there or will he just go up there during a cutscene? For. Yes, thanks for asking. How are you feeling? Sleep well? What do you want with those papers? Why, I aim to use them to continue important work that a man's tragic death put on hold. Alexander was studying the Catriona Plague. I'll use his notes to produce medication, perhaps a cure, or at least a vaccine. <laughs> Strictly humanitarian motivations, is that it? No, strictly selfish ones. The mighty would pay willingly for such a remedy. Can you imagine how much? Take Radovid, for instance. Why, he might even consider forgetting my past associations with the Lodge. Radovid doesn't forget, and Radovid doesn't forgive. Especially when it comes to sorceresses. He'll make an exception for me. He'll have to. I have something he wants. Please, you don't believe that. Well, you believe Yennefer will stop treating you like a dog someday. Don't see me laughing. I'm going to see Radovid. Tell him of this research, whether you like it or not. This is suicide, Kira. You'll wind up tied to a stake. Burned to bolster the morals of the masses while entertaining them. Shut up for a moment and look at me. See this? Bed bugs, Geralt. Bloody bed bugs. I, Kira Metz, advisor to Foltest, a member of the Lodge of Sorceresses, have bed bugs. Think what you will, but I'll not stay in this bloody swamp one day more. Not one day. I shall cross the Pontar, and that means Radovid's men will find me sooner or later. Don't you understand? I don't have a choice. I will have to parley. Got another option. Go to Kaer Morhen. You believe I'd be safe there? As long as you don't piss Lambert off, yes. Amir, Radovid, neither will be able to reach you. Find little in the way of luxury there, but... We do have clean sheets. It's a long way, well beyond the dividing line. But if I keep to the woods until I reach the Kestrel Mountains, I should pass through unnoticed. So be it. Seems I find it hard to refuse you, handsome. You've <laughs> clearly a notion of what women want. Hell yeah. yeah. So, see you at Karamoran? Beds free of bed bugs, mostly. <laughs> I long to be there already. See you, Geralt. <laughs> I hate that when it happens in the game. The channel, my dude. <laughs> okay. So we just finished the Kira Metz mission, and now we're going to. Just sift through other things. We should probably do the Family Matters one. Uh, let's do the Lady... Yeah, Ladies of the Wood. I like this mission. 
Okay. Yeah, let's do this one first. Um, I don't think there's a boat near me, sadly. <laughs> so we're going to have to do this the hard way. Been in and out of jobs. Finally found one of that uh, is well enough. A complete waste of the day. Yeah, I think a lot of people now nowadays are looking for a job that they, you know, it's sustainable. <laughs> and that's the hardest part, I think, is for most people to find a job like that. It's like, is this job sustainable to where I can pay all the bills and also feed myself? <laughs> is it? Is it? We'll find out in like a month. <laughs> Usually after your first or second paycheck, you kind of figure out, it's like, nah, this job ain't worth it. <laughs> yeah, I think it takes like your second paycheck to figure that out, because your first paycheck is always going to be pretty small. Right, let's talk to this dude. What? What? Got anything interesting? I'm looking for more Gwent cards. Oh, also, apparently I don't have that. I will take these. Take that. I'll take all your Gwent cards. Also, what's this cream? Oh, alchemy paste. And oh, shortly lure. Short, short. Actually, probably didn't need to buy that because I think you learned that in um in a future mission. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Farewell. Hmm. Hey, as I say, at this point in time, I, I think we're pretty much to the point, at least over here in America, to where it's like, as long as there's a job that keeps us alive and gives us a chance to do whatever we need to do, <laughs> we're, we're doing okay. <laughs> I'm surprised my bombs didn't you know, reimbursed. Hmm. Do need to sell some of this. Hmm. Uh. I don't remember if there's a blacksmith here. There is a blacksmith. Yeah. I need him to repair some of my stuff. Sent my youngins to pick mushrooms yesterday. To the woods. And then I grow up now. I want to be a boys who taste his armor. Alright. Let's talk to you, dude. Trusty arms for all sorts. Steel swords and strong maces for the menfolk, <laughs> and grave knuckle dusters for the ladies. Yeah, I know uh, what <clears throat> the winter season for at least us, anyway, might be a little tight. We'll try our best to Show me your keep everything bundled up, though. Literally and figuratively. <laughs> keep everything bundled up. Hmm... Oh, is that a new saddle? Let's see, that is a better sa saddle. Mastercrafted saddle, it's about 290. I'll take it. Do you have anything else, sir? Do you have any of the blinders for the horse? No, Mueller, Mueller. Hmm. 
Hmm. Don't need that. Don't need these. Sell these. <laughs> Good with that. Good with that. And we're pretty much good with that. Um, why does Porsche have a trophy emoji? Where? <laughs> is it like on the phones or something like that? Or is it like uh, on Twitch? Let's see. Oh, it's a global emote. Um, I know Porsche did something on Twitch about half a month ago, maybe. Yeah, Tor Porsche. I don't know what they did. I don't know if they like announced like a new a new Porsche, like the 2020 or the 2021 version that they're working on right now. But yeah, Porsche did something uh, on Twitch not too long ago. I was like, oh, I didn't know they had an <laughs> emote. <laughs> didn't know that. Didn't really care. <laughs> yeah, so T Porsche has an emote. So long. I'll start doing Gwent stuff, I think, probably after the Ladies of the Wood. I just want to get further into the actual main story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been dead for like five months. Yeah, I haven't missed too much. Nothing much really going on on Twitch except for some new implements that are being added as we go. Um, if you missed some of the news, uh, next month, most likely all channels will have their own point system. So you know how the point system that I have right now, if you know anything about my the booty bumps and redeeming actual games for watching the channel and stuff like that. Well, it looks like everyone's about to get something like that to where uh, people will be able to unlock like, you know, emotes and stuff and you know, do all, you know, whatever you want it to do. So, but I think they will have a little bit more flexibility when it comes to that stuff. So that's something that Twitch is doing in the next month. So. I don't know when they're actually going to release it, but I heard it was like maybe on the 15th. Not too sure though. Last time dealt with channel points was like a year ago. Damn. I don't even remember commands. Well, there's a command for that. Exclamation point commands. Which I might actually have to update that because there are... Like uh, maybe a handful of commands that aren't either there anymore or I need to add some more commands. <clears throat> but most of the stuff is usually hands-on now. No need for commands and stuff like that anymore. A lot of the stuff is just, you know, even for mobile users, people that are watching the stream on the phone um, can check out how many points they have and shit through their actual phone. Don't even have to leave the stream. Mm. Mm. I was supposed to be going to the swamp, what the hell? Well, might as well do the trail of treats one way or another. I 
FR. What do you mean by FR? <laughs> uh, like how do you check your like points while you're on the phone um it's been a while but like i think if you well since you're actually open hmm. i think all you do is you let's see where would it be there should be oh they don't have the jigsaw thing anymore like, if you're not looking at the chat, um, what do you call it, landscape-wise, and you go portrait mode, uh, like turning your phone to portrait mode, you should find a little icon that has the Streamlabs dude with the, you know, dude with the glasses and all that. Click on him, and uh, then you can see the points down at the bottom right. And that's how you do it. So yeah, there's there's little things you can click on. Oh. Try not to pass any stuff. And most likely that's gonna change in the future, who knows? Do I not? Hmm. Yeah, so just keep following the trail of treats. <laughs> oh, just 42 points? I guess you got some time. If you just hang out in here, you'll have enough to redeem any game. I stream enough to where people can rack up a thousand points in a matter of no time. That's why a thousand points is about a total of ten dollars worth of booty bumps. Yeah. We're we're gonna get a new slew of games pretty soon for you guys. I think uh I don't know if it's like next Friday or something like that, but Ooh. That's tempting. Most likely when I step in this water I'm gonna get attacked. No? All right, I didn't get attacked. That or I've already killed those monsters that were supposed to be here. Ah, here's the, uh, the infamous place. This is the mission of missions. This is like one of my favorite missions in the whole entire game. Doug went in the kitchen, stole a hunk of meat. Cook gave him a licking, strung him by his feet. Cooked and bled him empty, stripped his skin off clean. Laughed and said how tasty, best sausage I have seen. Cook's a stupid killer, shouldn't have ate the pup. Now we're light a fire, gonna roast him up. One, two, three, the one to fetch the kindlings. Interesting rhyme. Don't know you. Go away. <laughs> I'm looking for the witches of Crookback Bog. You look like a witch yourself. The w w witches of the bog. We can't go in the bog. Gran don't let us. When my brother Zamek went missing, Gran said it was because he went in the woods and got lost. Gran cried an awful lot after that. He could still come back. What are you doing out here alone? We's not alone. We's with Gran. But where did you all come from? We's orphans. All of you? There's a war. 
So there's orphans. Didn't know that. Yeah, wars create orphans. <laughs> a young woman got lost in the swamp. She has ashen hair and a scar on her face. You kids see anyone like that? Ain't no lassies here. What am I? You're no lassie. Lassie's got tits. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. I didn't know man say once. Damn vile. Here, he says, I them lasses in the woods. They's dazzling the soldiers with their tits. And it's torturing the poor lads. That's what he said. Listen, the girl I'm looking for, she's in trouble. I understand you might not want to help me, but you could try to help her. How do you know she was here? I heard she visited the witches in the swamp. But there's no witches here. There's only frogs. And snakes. And Johnny. What's this, John? Ah, uh, Johnny. What kind of jabbering is this, eh? No one allowed here. Just kids. My kids. They're allowed. But who are you? Wearing swords like a bandit. Who's Johnny? Johnny, Johnny ate a cat. Come the more in some furry shack. Watch your language. <laughs> they tell tales and tales, nor but tales. Yeah, Johnny looks really interesting in this game. Are you one of the witches of the swamp? I hear Crookback Bog. Witch? Me? Nay, I've no broom nor owl, and not one wart on me nose. Got a pretty nose, see? Gwen's got a lovely beak. <laughs> oh, beak. you darling girl. Oh, kids are so sweet. <laughs> That's such a British thing to say. <laughs> you got a lovely beak. <laughs> you look after these kids? They're my grandchildren. Gran's good to us. Gonna be soup with scratchings for supper. Kids get lost in the woods. I miss him. Seen him in the woods. No one has. Just talking to the kids. Asked them if they'd seen a young woman. Oh, it was a lovely young woman. Wore a long, beautiful braid my mummy did up for me. Had dresses with flowers on them. Maybe you've seen her. Young, ashen hair. You're betrothed. Daughter, actually. Daughter? My dear, sweet little daughter and her sister. Where are they now? Maybe they've come to some harm. A bit of help, please. A young, ashen-haired woman. Just need to know if you've seen her. What are you looking at, children? Wash your hands, we'll go catch crickets. Won't learn anything from you. Aye, because I don't know nothing. That Johnny knows. He knows a lot. When I ask him something, he says, wait, I'll scratch my arse and tell you. Ugly word. What you saying? To the hut. You'll stand in the corner. I'll make sure you do. You. Be gone. Be gone. Can't come in here. Not allowed in here. I just want to talk to the boy. Not allowed. It's not allowed. He won't talk to you anyway. Gran don't like you. And and Johnny's made up. And, and stranger still, kids. Just got one question for you. Don't be asking no questions. You're a stranger. Not allowed to talk to strangers. Can we eat now? Soup with scratchings. You here? Says he's afraid of you. Stop scaring my kids. Why don't you want to talk about Johnny? One of you knows about him. The others must too. It's just him who's pals with Johnny. They pick mushrooms and hunt snails. But Gran says Johnny's made up. 
Have any of you ever seen John? Of course. Looks just like him. Then why do you say he's made up? Gran says so. And Gran knows lots. Does your Gran treat you right? She ever hurt you? Never. When we're bad, she cries. She's scared. Say strangers might take us. And we'll disappear. The boy who plays with Johnny, he must be brave. Not brave, just stupid. Sat his bare bum on an anthill once. But yeah, he plays with Johnny. He don't listen to Gran and goes in the woods, and then he's got to have a time out. And he eats snails. Yuck. The girl I mentioned is in danger. You gotta help me get your gran away from the hut so I can talk to Johnny's friend. All right, but you've gotta do something for us too. Play hide and seek. Gran never does. Says her feet hurt. Let's play. You hide, but if I find you, you have to help me talk to the boy who knows Johnny. He thinks he'll find us easy. Means he's never hid from the black ones. No looking, and you have to count out loud. All your fingers, toes, too. One, two, three, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Ready or not, here I come. Found you. You can stop hiding. How'd you find me? See you. Aww. Found you. You can stop hiding.
one left hiding. You're a wizard, right? Gonna show us some tricks when we get to the cottage. No, we'll talk about your promise. Found you all. Now you gotta keep your word and help me talk to Johnny's friend. Why wouldn't we? Promised, didn't we? She's busy. Why are you scared to talk? You're not scared of nothing. You're all scared of something. Would have told me about Johnny otherwise. I'm worried about Johnny. He don't come round no more. Once, when we was mushroom picking, I saw his burrow. But Gran yelled at me. Said not to talk to strangers, cause then kids go missing. She worries about Johnny, too, though she says he's made up. Where are you and your friend's parents? Dead. Some starved. Others were killed. Like mine. One day, they went out at dawn to look for berries in the woods. Still some around back then. When I was coming home, I heard the yells, then laughing, went up and hid in the bushes near the woods. My mum yelled, and the soldiers laughed. Lay my pot down by the barn door, his head clean off, and then my mum... It's all right, that's enough. I just want to talk to Johnny. He could know more than you. Not gonna hurt him, right? Cause he's real. He's not made up. I'm not gonna hurt him. Johnny used to be boy, cause Gran liked listening to his songs. When we was picking mushrooms, Johnny said he saw a girl with ashen hair in the swamp. Where can I find Johnny? There is a little meadow on the edge of the swamp. This strange tree grows there. Look around. You'll see him. Thank you. What are you on about? Who said us? Hey? Eh? Ugly word, ugly. Don't cry, Yagna. Yagna's a stupid pig. Name calling's not allowed. Small footprint. Johnny's been through here.
tracks lead to a burrow. Wonder what's inside. Johnny? Don't be afraid. You're a bucker? A Luton? Ah, a godling. Not many of you left. I'm looking for a woman with ashen hair. Seen her? Tell me everything from the start. Where did you see her? What was she doing? It's important to me. Why not? You know the kids from the clearing well? Yeah, you Don't can't be afraid. It's not going to hurt anyone. <laughs> this where you live? Cozy burrow. Good location. Must know about everything that happens in the bog. <laughs> Doesn't bother you having monsters for neighbors? What's wrong? Can't talk? Why? <laughs> Lost your voice? Can I help you somehow? Think I can. Can't understand you. Try to explain it somehow. <laughs> Just do it, forehead. Want me to follow you? No choice, I guess. Well, that's like I don't need ne more necrophage oil. Clean in half. Stay close to me. Or I should stay close to him. Place? Let me look around. Something's on the ledge? Something that'll get you your voice back? Guess I gotta make this climb. to go the other way around. I think there's uh, most likely a harpy nest. Oh. Is that the reason why I can't climb? Is because of freaking harpies?
Uh, got the wrong thing. My first time fighting harpies. Yeah. So they drop mutagens just like the Neckers do. Yippers. Now what's in here? Sealed bottle and Raven's feather. Let's see if I can just slide down. Yep. Here. Hmm. I guess his voice is in there. Whiskey, slither, ringworm, rubbish, bumblebee, flabbergasted. <laughs> the sound of it. <laughs> Peter Piper picked Prince Proximo a pack of pickle peppers by the pontar. <laughs> Done celebrating. <laughs> My favorite words. Life without savoring the sound of surreptitious shenanigans is like licking snails through a cloth. Thank you for this, noble whoever you are. Long be your life. Hang on a minute. I helped you, now you help me. Would you turn this beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors? How do you lose your voice? One morning I awoke and opened my mouth for my usual bout of singing with the thrushes. Lo and behold, no sound escaped. I tried and tried, almost burst a blood vessel. Then I went to the village, because word has it the new cunning woman works miracles. But people began crying out, a smudger, a smudger, and sick their dogs on me. Do I look like a smudger to you? Not a bit. Well, I thought not. <laughs> so it must be the crones doing. Who else would curse me? Blackbird friend of mine located my voice, but I was helpless to retrieve it. Couldn't ask a raven friend to just give you the bottle? Ravens serve the crones. They don't help no one. How do you lock someone's voice in a bottle? Just wondering. As am I, especially as mine's the voice to crown all voices. Sometimes it's like a forest brook. At others, like a roll of thunder. And let's be honest, I talk enough to fill three barrels or more. Somebody used some powerful magic on you, as a prank or just to be mean. I'm looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. My favorite part of the day. <laughs> Defecating to the sunrise, downright glorious. <laughs> Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared, out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired, just like you said. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's hut. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my morn. Sadly, I'd lost my voice, so I don't think she heard me. What do you know about the crones? They're as old as this forest. Cruel. Vindictive. Not to be crossed. What if someone does cross them? Might take his voice. Might take his life. Depends on their whim. They're nasty. Although, they care for this land and its folk in their own way. Supposedly, they always keep their word. But you must be careful what you ask for. Won't find them until they want to be found. See them until they want to be seen. But remember, they see and hear all that happens in the mire. I've been to the village in the swamp, met a woman who might have been a crone. Did she seem confused to you? Nuts, completely. Oof, so I'm not crazy. That's no crone. That's the granny who takes care of the orphans. Claims the kids made me up. Me. An orphanage in a swamp? What do you have against swamps? <clears throat> Lived here my whole life, and I heartily recommend it. <laughs> she ran off toward the orphanage. Kids could know something, or the old woman who takes care of them. Oh, that old hag don't speak to strangers, 
And you're a stranger. Will she talk to you? I have spoken to her, got my ways. So be it. You helped me and I'm no bore. Come with me. Thanks. Much appreciated. Necrophage oil. Damn it. Dead. Still something I need to kill. Hmm. Drink that beer. Or champagne. I think it is an L. This is called Vizeman. Yeah, Vizeman Champion. <laughs> it's not a champagne, just a champion. to have lost an octave somewhere in the process. I shall look for it when I get home. <laughs> You're not allowed here, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. The woman I asked about earlier. Forgive me, Gran, but this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No. She's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. Gran, please hear me out. I found little Yagna when she got lost, did I not? Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. I ask anything in return? No. Didn't even fuss about my stolen voice. Well, now I want something. Gran, help this fellow. Because otherwise he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. His lass is missing. Perhaps the ladies can help find her, eh? Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. Come with me. <laughs> well, you, it's just the way he just blinks his eyes, too. It's just <laughs> Johnny's a good, good lad, though the ladies don't like him. No, foul creature, they say. Don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies, lovely, with power o'er all. Beseech I thee, answer my call. 
Before you a worm crawls, wretched and small. How dare you disturb our rest, woman? Someone speaking through you? Good looking and clever, too. Where have you been hiding, boy? I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Perhaps he only likes ashen haired girls. Young woman. She's my daughter by choice. I raised her. <laughs> if she's shapely, what does it matter? <laughs> Matters to me. I believe we've hit a nerve. He's bubbling like well fed yeast. Oh, that's how I like Sims. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me, have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Oh, hard times are upon this white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has surfaced near Down Warren. It feeds on hatred and disdain. Destroy the beast, and we may be grateful. Tell you all we know about this ashen haired maid. Dark power? You need a knight errant, or a witch hunter, not a witcher. The alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. And now, our servant will bring you the dagger. A dagger? What for? When the Alderman sees this dagger, he'll know we sent you. He'll aid with all. I'll talk to the Alderman, but I can't promise anything. Move, woman! Give the young man the dagger! And you, white one. Return only once you've completed the task. Oh, you mistress, right. On me way. Dagger. Gotta bring the dagger. The dagger. For you. Lady told me to give it to you. Here it is. The dagger. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. Stone bear, stone shear, stone nose, stone ears. All right, let's talk to the alderman. It's kind of weird to say, but I don't. Since the first day of uh, playing Witcher, I haven't had a day where it's exclusively been Witcher. Because later on today, we're gonna be playing a game that just came out today. Not not the Surge Two, but we are playing a, another game that came out today. <laughs> the only reason why I didn't request a key for the Surge Two was mainly because I haven't played the first one yet. I felt that it would be a little oh be a little unnecessary <laughs> to redeem a request a 
code for a game I haven't even played. Ow. There we go. Ah. Anyway, I'm trying to do it again. Yeah. Oh, almost did it. Trying to get that timing down. Oop, there we go. <laughs> Ooh, chopped his arm off. Ouch. Never really was a Witcher fan, but I guess like uh, Diablo, just watching the stream gets you interested. It just back up. Like, I never really been a huge, like, the Witcher never really caught my attention until the third one. Like, once the third one came out, I fell in love with the the series. Thing is, the first game is almost impossible to get into unless you can deal with a game that kind of has somewhat of bad mechanics and pretty bad graphics. <laughs> it's not a very pretty game. The first one. The second one, however, is pretty decent. But, uh, other than that, it's probably best to just play the third one and enjoy that. If you ever feel like playing the Witcher games, play the, definitely play the, uh, the third one. You can even play it on the Switch now. Woo! <laughs> Which is interesting. I'm kind of wo really wondering how it looks on the Switch. I could redeem a key for the Switch version. I was kind of thinking about it. It's like, maybe I should try and redeem it for the Switch. See how it looks. Greetings. Because this is on the PS4, so I don't have the PC version, but the PC version looks fucking gorgeous. Nice village. Boy, a real pearl of the swamps, if you say so. You get by all right? Aye, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? Master, I didn't know you belonged to them. Don't belong to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the Whispering Hillock they lie. Unburied, all oh, fathers, sons, daughters, and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. Need more details. You must see for yourself. Me grand's mum whacked me crosswise for straying near the Whispering Hillock. But what happens there now is a wonder. A few times folk from round here gathered to chop down the trees and burn the cursed soil back to use. None returned. The ground beneath the weeds is white with human bones. When did all this start? 
three year back. I remember, it was a warm day, went to check the snares for game. I pulled the hair from me trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. I thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air, near burst me ears. The hair rotted in me hands, and the leaves shriveled and yellowed, though it were yet the start of summer. Times have been ill ever since. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women folk fight like polecats, bawling and brawling over nothing. The young'uns, born crippled, lame, fear and cursing. Long have we pled for the ladies' help. Ladies of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they, for they sent you. I'll look around the whispering hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't ye treat this evil light. All right. <clears throat> also go on the snow sport. Look at all this stuff. Should be very good. Let's see. Talk to this dude. Milk, freshly curdled milk. Egg straight from the coop. Nary a trace of shit on him. <laughs> Nearly a trace of shit on him. Show me what you sell. All right. Turn those in. Let's see. Don't really sell anything else, does he? Hmm. Got all this stuff in my pouch. So long. Hmm. Alright. Well, let's go to there. Go to the downworn. Oh, you addicted to the point scratchers? See, see, the thing is, I totally forgot they were there. I even forgot about the whole uh, um, little mini games that you guys can play while watching the stream <laughs> because of Streamlabs. It's like, oh man, I did forget about that stuff. <laughs> Because the, the thing is, there's a lot of people... There's a lot of people that watch the stream on the phone, so they don't get to see that stuff. Or, they'll see some of this stuff. But I do know that a lot of people that watch Twitch on the phone only see like a quarter of the things that they should see. Like, better Twitch TV emotes, uh, Frankenface Z stuff. You know, having the ability to never see an ad <laughs> is also a very nice thing that a lot of phone users can't do unless they have a homebrew um, phone. <laughs> if I'm correct, there might be werewolves coming up. Or maybe I'm thinking of something else. Looks like rain. Mm-hmm. Sure does sound like monsters. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> Nearly lost your points that way. Oh, the scratchers? <laughs> I think it's the wolves I need to worry about. Okay. Ooh, there is a werewolf. Uh, cursed one, I think? Is a werewolf a cursed one? <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, it is. 
What do I need? Just Cursed One and Igni. Um, do I have Cursed Oil? Werewolves will fuck you up in this game. Uh, Vampire, Elementa, Cursed Oil. There we go. And let's get Igni. Oh, there's no music going on. like a freaking train. Is he regenerating? Motherfucker. gonna come back. Yeah, he's gonna come back. This is being an asshole. Wait, he healed! Mother... Fuck. Unless this is a different werewolf. I don't think it I don't think it's a different werewolf. Ah. I oh I'm blocked. <laughs> I'm going a different way. <sighs> don't let him run away. His healing factor is stupid. <clears throat> I totally forgot. <laughs> how do you, I don't remember how you keep him from healing. Um, must be in his bestiary. I must be missing something. I think it's moon dust. Uh, the moon dust bomb. Moon dust. Puff ball. I wonder if I have any of those. I could easily make them too. Moon dust. I have the dancing star. That might have to work. Use any of the bombs to Samus. Time to end this. Yeah, it keeps healing, man. It's a piece of shit. Accident to change my freaking thing. Damn it. Damn it, it keeps running away like a piece of shit. the game glitched.
Why isn't his health dropping as fast as it should? <sighs> Fuck, he's gonna kill me. Damn it. Go back to fucking Igni. I can put the oil back on, which is gonna help. There we go. Come on, you bastard. It keeps fully healing. Swords are already hurt, too. Shit. <laughs> that motherfucker. Show yourself. I want to talk. I almost died. <laughs> Shit. Oh, and I can meditate. Need to repair my weapon, man. <laughs> Igni's not working, you, you just use something else. <laughs> that whole entire fight, I don't think the music was working a lick of, <laughs> a lick of sense. This thing's earlier. First stream of cotton in five months. <laughs> I can't. Uh, some people's been away from. Some people been it's away from uh, it's be. Twitch for a good long time. Got an ability point. Let's see. Ooh, I got two points to spend. Vedinesu. Oh, and I could put a mutagen here too. Oh, let's not do that. Let's see. I want my next mutagen to be red. I have a red mutagen. What other rare wolf, rare wolf mutagen might actually work? Because it's a mixture of what? Green and red, maybe? Hmm. Need to put that one there. Means my yeah attack power went up by fifteen percent because I did that. Vetiness. Then I'm gonna just put the blue mutagen. Well, actually, hmm. All the points are there. Put another point in arrow deflect. Hmm. Now, gonna see what else I can put into combat. Precise blows, increase the chance of landing a fast attack. Critical hit by 2%. Hmm. Blow. Fleet. Fleet footed. Damage from hits received while dodging is reduced by 20%. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, cold blooded. 
That's for bolt stuff and undying. When vitality reaches zero, adrenaline points will immediately be consumed to restore it. Oh, so it's like a second win thing. That's very nice. Hmm. Is that 106? Oh, uh, 186? Um, you get a point every minute, so that might be the case. Don't know. <laughs> Don't know what your points were last time, unless you said 138. Which it wasn't that... Hasn't been that long for you to get that many amount of points again. Uh, let's see... I do precise blows. Then we'll put it under here. Then we'll need to get another green. Hmm, roots don't seem to be, will allow me in or not. Okay, it's dark in this. Very dark, I can hardly see anything. Hopefully there's breathe holes. Oh, there are breathing holes, nice. Okay, what do we have here? Oh no! The uh, the audio's messed up. There's supposed to be a voice right there. I was attacked. Um. Hmm. I'm kind of wondering if I can save and reload because the audio is all glitched out. Murderers. One second. Damn it! I can't. Who are you? One second. Never heard of it. I'm gonna see if I can like back out of it <laughs> and like see if I can do something. Why did? I know I. I didn't break the Witcher. The bro Witcher broke itself. <laughs> I didn't do shit. <laughs> I'm not gonna agree to help it. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can load up uh Save real quickly, ladies. A uh, you know, checkpoint. I think this might be a good checkpoint. Maybe. Depends on where it loads me up. <sighs> While searching for the witch Siri, we don't need world, this. Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. Sorceress told the Witcher about a masked mage. Siri had seen the hidden to shelter it. in his hideout. The Witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Siri had never reached the Elven Mage, yet the Wild Hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The Witcher felt that all was lost, until Kira gave him a new lead. The Crones of Crookback Bog. Yeah, I couldn't skip that though. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I was just trying to figure out if this is the right save or not. <laughs> and uh, the idea didn't like deem across my head until uh, it was too late. I was like, oh, I could have saved and then reloaded that save to fix the audio, but it was too late. <laughs> it's like, I knew there was supposed to be something talking to me. 
No. And it also made me wonder if uh, that's why the uh, werewolf was hard, uh, like a little too hard almost to kill, because um, it might have been glitched. Yeah, I didn't fix it. I'm just gonna have to read the subtitles, I guess. Yeah, there's supposed to be a voice there. I was attacked. Murderers. Well, see you, Demoman. Thanks for uh, stopping on by for so long. Catch you later. Never heard of a druid circling Velen. Must know the crones pretty well. Kids from the meadow are in danger. Where'd they take them? I can help. So weird without the voice. All because the audio all glitched out and shit. See what I got. Nice. Shit, damn. Diamond dust. Men 
medallions humming. Place of power, it's gotta be. Hmm. Oh, they're checking on the werewolf. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? An evil spirit had possessed a tree on the hill. It was responsible for the killings. How'd ye dispel this evil? Some being had come to possess the tree's heart. I destroyed the heart and its inhabitant. So it were a ghost? Will it be back? No. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. She's... Yeah, I have a feeling the audio is a little bugged out. I might have to like turn the game on There's and off. Payment. <laughs> Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? It is our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So all those ears in the woods. Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving, and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive must seek his own protectors. Yeah, let's see if I can uh, fix the audio real quickly. I definitely don't want to continue this with a broken audio. Yeah, there's supposed to be music and everything and ambiance and stuff like that. And I think the audio is like legit broken. I need to like restart the game. Because it's not supposed to be this way. <laughs> uh, oh, there they are. Okay, I need to restart the fucking game because this is getting me fucking really annoyed. That I can't hear shit. Hmm. Let me restart it. Hmm. Hopefully the audio <laughs> like isn't broken now. Yeah. Also. I've played long enough to where my controller is pretty much about dead. Alright, let's see if I fix the damn audio. Come on, come on. Watch what would be weird is like the save files are now corrupted. <laughs> oh, I'd be so mad. Right. Um, continue where I left off. While searching for the witch Siri had quarreled with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. The sorceress told the witcher about a masked mage. Siri had seemed to taken shelter in his hideout. The witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Siri had never reached the elven mage, yet the wild hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The witcher felt that all was lost. Until Kira gave him a new lead. The crones of Crookback Bog. Skug, thanks for the follow. Ah. <sighs> 
All right, let's see if that fixes the audio issue that Witcher 3 tends to have at one point or another in a very, very few blue moons. <laughs> Need to make sure. So I want to get to a certain point in the playthrough of Witcher before I cover the game that I'm planning on covering tonight. So, oh shit. Oh, wait. Hmm. Don't know if that fixed the audio, but I hear music now. Maybe. Might not be music. Uh, let's find out. Place of power. Should draw from it. I'm gonna meditate for a second. Yeah, there's supposed to be music Solved here. Problem. What the fuck? Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. An evil spirit. How? Hmm. Some being. So it were a goat. Will it be back? No. The crop. I, I do. Yeah, we're supposed to hear. There's payment. Music and everything. It is our. So. Put it out your mind. No gods, nor. Hmm. That bugs me. I really hope it's not bugged throughout the whole entire game after that. There we go. We got music here now. I don't know what bugged it. I fixed the bug, though. Never seek to cross us again. We shall forgive you this transgression for you've done well. Your children are plump as piglets, sweet as caramel. But now we must talk to our white-haired friend. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come. It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. You used me to tame the Whispering Hillock. A lot of work. Not free, brave soul. Did you destroy the evil powers? Have you brought peace to our domain? Yes. So fortunate to have found so brave a knight, so able. What 
did you need the children for? We? We? They needed us? Our care. Where are they? They are far away. Their troubles are over. You looked different in the tapestry. We're all dressed up just for you. If you only knew how much time we spent in front of the glass. Do you desire us? Uh, no. You know why I'm here. You know what I want. You shall dream of us and return for what you reject. They always come back. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Thin as a veil. Terrified. Exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. The young woman I seek never hurt anyone without cause. You've not seen her long. She's changed for the worse. Why'd she attack you? She's no longer the girl you once knew. Wrath consumes her. Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood. The soul seed that would burst into flame. She fell into our hands. The blood! Mm, the blood of the traitress. Does she sleep? Like a lamb. Come, sisters, no point in dawdling. The table's set. The cauldron bubbles. We cannot! You know she is meant for him! Emirates will get her. He will, but not whole. <laughs> well said. We'll just have a sample. I'll take her feet. Lovely. Mm, plump. Perfect for a broth. Oh, I can taste it already. Very well. Get on with it! Oh, you'll regret that girl. Regret it dearly.
I think they're gonna be never ending if I kept fighting there. <laughs> Tried to kill her. Tried to butcher her like an animal and eat her. Her blood. The taste brought back the memories of our youth. Elder blood. Extraordinary girl. But you know that. Such a shame she fled. You tried to kill her. Can't forgive you for that. Waste of words. Our fates are bound true. But now is not the time for that to bear fruit. Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Each time you see her, she will be a mirage. And if you find her, if... <laughs> All right. Now we gotta tell the Baron that we found his wife. Fight drowners. Ow, ow. Piece of shit. swamp area. Go. Damn it. <laughs> You're supposed to jump up. Mm 
Go to Crow's Perch. Yep. Do that first, I guess. for a second. Talk to him real quick, like. I'm listening. What do you come to me with? Okay, I think before we start this, I do need to play Gwent with him, or else I'm gonna lose that opportunity. Ever play Gwent? I do. And what's more, I usually win. If you've a deck, sit down. Outplay me, and I'll give you one of my unique cards. That for enticement. Let's lay him down. Put that in. Ooh, I like dummy ones. Mm. I keep that in. Hmm. A lot of good cards though on my hand. Not these two that are pretty damn decent. Hmm. Damn it, really? Holy shit. You made a decent man. Fuck. <laughs> hmm. two of those. Mm. 
<laughs> took one of his spy cards. That's funny. Trying to figure out how I'm gonna tackle this. Maybe I should play one more card. This. Didn't really have a good hand. up that round yeah, it gets like an extra card too which sucks all right be as unique he might actually have beaten me <laughs> definitely has probably beaten me now since he has three other guards left this jackass Complete shite, but you really should work on your technique. I'm listening. What do you come to me? Didn't have a good hand. I would like to try again. <laughs> In the mood for a round of Gwent? <laughs> Let's lay him down. We'll get his unique card. Okay. Let's see what my hand gives me. Hmm. Not too bad, but it's not great either. Play the smart. Let's see. Hmm. So 
So he's gonna do the same thing I did right there. Take one of these. Hmm. So we'll force him to play at least one of those cards. But he still wins by a point. Shit. Hmm. Wouldn't hurt. Might have to absolutely beat him in the next round or else I'm screwed. <laughs> beat me by one point. Fuck off. Oh, I'm still winning though. Alright. I think he might have screwed himself over with that card. But the spy card. Fucking asshole. <laughs> Wait. Okay, I passed around. He can't lose another round. He has to have at least 22 points. Oh, another spike guard? You fucking kidding me? Oh. Nope, I win. <laughs> As I'll say, the spike cards could really change the game, too. That's the thing. But it's not super overpowered. You won. Yes. The man's only as good as his word. Take the card. Thank you. I fear Velen's short on worthy opponents. Boat builder in Oriton might be one. There was also an old soothsayer lived east of here near the windmill last I heard. There's a lad about as reasonable as an old mare, but he plays a devilish hand. In fact, I don't rightly know that you're ready for him. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to play the Baron before we continue this mission. What do you come to me with? I think when you do this mission, your chance of doing Gwent with him is completely over. Depending on what happens. Plowing hell, why'd you not say so forthwith? Where is she? Why have you not returned with her? She's in Crookback Bog. Got food, a place to live, and keeps herself busy. Didn't look like she had the slightest desire to leave. You were to bring her back, not report on the condition she lives under. I was supposed to find her, and I did. That was our deal, nothing more. You still think me rotten to the core. A base bastard, don't you? You believe I alone am at fault for what happened here. Doesn't matter what I believe. 
Yet, looking at you, I see contempt. Can't speak for the world you witches inhabit, but in ours, nothing is ever black and white. Probably gonna say you're not the only one to blame. All right then, I'm willing to hear your side of the story. With Annie, it was love at first sight. A spear tore through my shoulder at the Battle of Anchor. She tended to my wound. Once I'd recovered, I asked her to marry me. She wept with joy. Soon after, Tamara was born. And after that, they sent me to Sidaris. A warlord had risen against King Athen, and Faltest sent help. It was one battle to the next, one conflict after another. It was a life of war. I was seldom home, and I found comfort in drink. Grew so fond of hooch, I couldn't part with it when I did get home. Still seems like your fault to me. Will you let me finish? All right. What then? I went from front to front, battle to battle, collecting soldiers' coin, while Anna sat alone with the babe for months. Later, I learned she'd not been so alone after all. For nearly three years, she'd found comfort in the arms of one Evan, a childhood friend, a dog's bunghole. Understand, damn it? One tussle in the hay I'd have waved aside, put it out of my mind. But the woman cuckolded me for years, without a whisker of concern for me, for my love. How do you find out? Came home one day and Anna was gone. The things too. Found a letter. She wrote that she didn't love me. That she'd left me for that knob liquor and taken Tamara with her. Felt like I'd been rammed in the ass by a horse. I went to find the bugger. To get the girls back. Bring them home. Yet soon as I saw him, something turned inside me. Something dark. I slaughtered the shit-eating twat and fed his carcass to the dogs. Guess they call you the Bloody Baron for a reason after all. What? Your nickname. Makes sense now. No, no, that's an entirely different story. Imagine Anna wasn't exactly pleased. Ha! Bloody understatement if I've ever heard one. She flew into a fit. Hysteria. Threw herself at me, kicking and clawing. Finally grabbed a knife. It would have been the end of me if I'd not leapt aside. It was the first time I hit her. I had to calm her. Felt I had no other means. Things changed. They would never be the same. Anna tried to take her own life, and mine, several times. She would prod me, goad me, taunt me, in the hope I would hit her again, perhaps. She'd scream that I'd robbed her a life of love, that I'd destroyed the idea for her, and so I might as well kill her. How many times I apologized. How many armfuls of blooms and gifts I brought. She cared not a bit. Two years of her anger had turned to indifference. Broken at times were her bouts of hysteria and my bouts of drunkenness. Cannot fathom how we survived those years. But we did. And as you know now, not everything was as it might have seemed. You're right. Faults on both sides, yours and hers. I'm content that you finally see that. Very well, then. If you won't bring Anna home, 
You might at least tell me how she landed in that blasted swamp. Your wife is with the crones, as their servant. What the fuck do you mean? <coughs> what crones? Ones who live in Crookback Bog. Oh, I've heard folk speak of them. I thought it naught but tales to scare the children with. How on earth did she land there? They fled by night. They were riding past the forest when a beast serving the crones attacked them and abducted Anna. A beast? Bloody hell. And Tamara? Was she hurt? No. Oh, thank the gods for that. So, Annie? What happened to her? The creature carried her deep into Crookback Bog. Didn't harm her, though. In fact, Anna seems content there. Content? What is this tripe, Witcher? What in bloody blazes is she doing in that swamp? She made a pact with the crones and... Well, I think she might have lost her mind. A pact? What the bloody hell? She was with child. A child she didn't want to bear. Went to the crones for help. They promised to rid her of the problem in exchange for a year of her service. And they kept their word in their own twisted way. What do you mean? Anna must have thought the child inside her would somehow disappear. Instead, the crone sapped her of strength and ultimately forced her body to miscarry. I think that's when she started to lose her mind. Mm. Then they placed magic tethers on her. Tethers that cause great pain when tested. A guarantee she'll pay off her debt. A pact with witches? Bloody nightmare sounds like some jest. We must get her out. We can't leave her there. Venturing into the swamp, even with armed men, is just a bad idea. It's a dangerous place inherently. And I think those crones are a greater threat than anyone realizes. I'll not sit on my ass waiting for them to return her. Would you wait? Count on their mercy if they had your daughter? Probably not. But I'm a witcher. And I'm a husband and a father who's fought off his life and the lives of his loved ones. I'll gather my men. Go there and retrieve Anna. We had a deal. I've done my part. Your turn to do yours. A word once given. Now what did I last? Basilisk. It had just attacked you. Ah, right. Gargantuan. One solid brute. It landed right in front of us. I thought we breathed our last. Watch out! If I don't survive this, you're to take whatever you want from the forces. You'll survive! <sighs> Let's show this bastard what we're worth! Oh. to get up there. Damn it! I can't leave him like that. Wait, wait. which way are we going? Ah, here we go. Oh wait, nope, never mind. Hmm. Ah, here we go.
There you Have everything? Yes, thank you. What you did for me, I, I shall never forget it. You helped me as well. When your man brought me here, you fed me, cared for me, had my wounds looked after. We're even now. You needn't leave. You're in good company here. We'll always have a warm corner for you. I must leave. Wraiths pursue me. The wild hunt. I was foolish to use the power. They're sure to have caught my scent. The wild hunt? Pursuing you? I'll endanger all of you by remaining here. You must tell the people to bar their doors and windows. And no one is to wander the night. And you? Where do you think you're going? Now, I ride for Novigrad. And then, who knows where? She mounted and rode off. It grew awfully empty without her. Redanian armies blocked the Pontar crossing. Yet you sent Ciri to Novigrad. She was looking for a sorceress, and all of them are in Novigrad. Besides, I didn't leave her at the Redanian's mercy. I gave her a letter of safe conduct. Where do you get these letters? I haven't always led this pack of jesters. Served in the Temerian army once. Redanians guard the crossing. True. But with a bit of fame and a friend here and there, well... Banners and heraldry don't mean so much. So there's a chance Ciri's still in Novigrad. Thanks for helping her. It's nothing. Now you've learned what you wanted to know, you must be in a hurry. But, if you could... Spit it out. I want to go get Anna. Free her, bring her back. I don't believe she's there willingly. Must have not heard me. Any journey into the swamp is suicide. I heard you, which is why I could use your aid. I've no more tales of Siri to offer you, but go with me and I'll be generous with what I do have. Very generous. Hmm. Extra coin never hurt. Ha! True indeed. I'll round up my men and ride to Down Warren. You can join us there. Fine. Sounds good. call him Uma and say he's a beast, but he seems a man to me, just hideous as Ardle's shit. Uma? Strange name. Aye, strange, but he gave us no other. You mean he can talk? Hardly. It was like this. I asked what they called him. He sat there, not saying a thing, trying to stick a toe up his nose. So I grabbed his hand, looked him in the eyes, and asked... What's your name? Gave me this damn foolish look and stammered. Ooh, Uma? And it stuck. Hmm. 
doesn't look like a monster, but my medallion's trembling. Strange. Where'd you find him? Funny story, actually. I won him in a game of cards. Must have been pretty desperate to play for that. Ah, quit your carping, smart ass. Someone wagered him and we played. If anyone was desperate, it was the bugger's former master. Funny story. How so? Went to Novigrad once to rest, indulge in the city's pleasures. Stayed at a tavern and some folk they were playing, so I joined in. Cards were kind that day. Had one devilish hand after another. Robbed the horsemen's blind. One fellow, a merchant, took it especially hard. He'd gambled away everything he'd brought from Skellige. Wanted terribly to play another hand, so I agreed. Asked him what he had to wager, and he showed me that sideshow. Not much in it for me, but fuck it, I thought. I'll give the man a chance to win something back. Luck was not with him. And Uma wound up here at Crow's Perch. End of story. Hilarious. Real side splitter. Oh, you wouldn't know a good tale from a runny fart. Proper baron now. Even got a jester. Aye. Now I feel something's not right with him. How so? Well, he seems more beast than man. But there's wisdom, cunning in the Bastard's eyes. Or maybe I'm imagining it. Ever run into anything like him? No, but he doesn't look dangerous. Hmm. I guess that's that. Doesn't eat much, so as long as he's no trouble, the boys might as well have some diversion. Time I was on my way. So long. Farewell. I hope you find your daughter. And prove a good father to her.